What's up, you guys? It's Matt here. So if we go over to SHIB burn and we look at what the burns have looked like for the last day, we're seeing a rise of 10%, but we're also seeing it at 1.1 million SHIB that has been burned. That's not a lot. We're expecting every single day to have multiple billions of SHIB burned because we were told that we would see burns within the 14th, the 15th, and the 16th. We didn't see any of those, right? And it, it gets you thinking like why they would even split it up in the first place, why we don't just see a million dollars worth of bone that gets uh, burned off in, in SHIB. Why we don't see that. And that starts, you know, raising questions. <clears throat> we don't have any type of transparency, so it creates speculation. They always wonder why people speculate all the time because we're promised something and we're never actually given it. So we're always wondering like, well, what could be the case? Give them the benefit of the doubt. And every time we think about what the benefit of the doubt could be, we start doubting everything that we're saying. We're like, oh, well, you know what? Maybe it's because of, you know, Shiba Swap 2.0 is now, or maybe it's because this just isn't updated, or maybe it's because um, there's a delay in the system and it makes it a little bit more difficult. No, you start thinking about it, there's there's no delays, there's no issues with anything on the back end from what we understand, but they're not making it clear if there is. And even if there was, we still would find a way to question those things uh, because we would want some answers to see if they're telling us the truth, especially with their track record, right? So we had dates of the 14th, the 15th, and the 16th, and we are now on the 16th and we have seen no burns from there. And if we go to, um, again, shibburn.com, if you want to go and check them out, they have the Shibarium tracker. Um, and you want to see what the burns look like or what the number still looks like. It's still sitting at one point, almost $1.1 million, 1 1.4 million bone. Now, that makes me think, and I talked about this yesterday, why they're not burning that overall amount. You know, I put out this tweet. Um, yesterday where the devs will burn they said that they will burn um on the 14th 15th and the 16th and i don't know if you saw that movie where it's just like what are you waiting for i think it's like scary movie or like the the parody version of of scream so yeah scary movie and uh yeah but what are you waiting for honestly what are you waiting for and it's accurate because i'm on the 16th and i'm like it's 16th it's the 16th today what are you waiting for like what's the hold up and I think I may know the reason. The reason why uh, I believe that we're not seeing the burn is because of how much of an impact it may have with bone. Understand that that's 1.4 million bone that you have there. There's like 250 million or total, right? 250 million total bone or 229 million total bone. If you look at 1.4 that's, you know, getting up in the range of, you know, 1%. That's starting to get up there to where it will have a massive impact because you're not seeing as much volume that's traded in bone. So if you go over here and you look at how much is being traded, 7 million in bone, that means that 1 million will be inherently negative towards this overall position. So if you see this at a downtime in the market, it will be at a massive downtime in the market because all of that is being sold to now um, burn Shiba Inu. So it's not really the best situation. That's why they wanted to one, split it up into three uh, payments and two, kind of probably wait for Bone to have an increased day or have a massive volume day before they can do that burn. They really don't want to do it. I think if anything, they want to burn off Bone or they want to um, take that money and, and do something with it that helps out their overall position. They never want to collapse their own position. That's the reason why they're waiting. That's the reason why they split it up. That's what I'm assuming, right? This is speculation, but it does seem right. It's 1.4 million Bone. That's $1.1 million dollars in uh, USD and maybe they're waiting for it to come down. I don't know in price because it did come down in price and that's why you're seeing it less than, um, you know, currently at a 1.2 or it was at a $1.2 million uh, accumulation pool and now it's at 1.1 or less than 1.1 because it's pinned to the price of bone and how that does fluctuate. So honestly, it's 
it's surprising or it's not surprising that they don't want to burn it because of the fact that it impacts their own position a lot more. So this goes to show that one, they they only care about, well, one, they didn't think about how this would be. Uh, they should have found a way to push that instead of into bone, into like Ethereum or something. So that would be easy way for them to burn. And uh, it also wouldn't impact their position right away. So it automatically gets converted over to Ethereum rather than being in bone because this does affect their position in a large way when there's $1 million worth of bone that's sitting in this accumulation pool, right? So that's my reasoning. I believe that that's the case. Now, I could be wrong. They could come out and say, no, that's not the reason. It won't impact bone. But it shows you that they hold bone here and it's worth one point, almost $1.1 million. And that will have a massive effect on bone overall with only $7 million that's traded. Overall, you look at the market cap, yeah, it won't have a, um, a longstanding effect uh, long-term because you know, it's 176 million. But when you're talking about the volume, yeah, majority of that volume will create a negative day and you just have to take that hit. That's why they wanted to wait 14th, uh, 15th and 16th, but they're going to wait probably a little bit longer and give us no information, um, you know, regarding that. And they thought that maybe it would create hype within SHIB and Bone and Leash and all of their products. And that's why they said, oh, we have a big announcement. Here it comes so that things can rise, but they didn't. So since they didn't, they didn't burn. So they don't care about SHIB. They don't care about SHIB investors. They've never cared about SHIB. They only care, and SHIB is seeing a rise, which is fantastic, and they probably hate that, but SHIB is seeing a little bit of a rise up to um, almost a, a drop zero, and uh, sitting at a one, or sorry, about a $6 billion market cap, it's at a $5.8 billion market cap because you have 589 um, you know, trillion coins. So looking at that at this level, it's 5.88, 5.89 uh, trillion or $5.89 billion there. But anyways, they've never cared about SHIB. They don't care about SHIB. All they care about is their bottom line with the positions that they created. And if they can't impact their positions, they don't want to help out the SHIB community. And I don't even think they want to do that, right? They don't think that anything helping out SHIB at this point, you know, everybody, or there's probably a lot of people that are invested in bone and believe in bone, but majority of the SHIB community is all about SHIB now because they've totally neglected SHIB. So anytime they do anything with SHIB, we're not trying to push into bone or leash or anything else. We're trying to just see the effect of SHIB Inu. So let me know your thoughts down below. Do you believe that that's the case that, the devs never cared about SHIB. They only care about pushing their own position, their own narrative within their positions and uh, their projects that they create. And do you believe that they're holding off because of the fact that it would impact Bone way too much and they don't care about the SHIB rise or what they promised to the SHIB community. They only care about Bone. And that goes to show that there are two separate ecosystems where you have Shiba Inu and the community there that really are pushing for burns and support for that for SHIB. And then you have people over here that really only care about bone and kind of kind of push the image that, oh, I'm all about SHIB, but you never really do anything for SHIB. You have to be forced to do it. Like we're trying to force you to make this burn. And I know you don't want to because of the fact that it will impact bone way too much. So that's my theory. You let me know what you think. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell for more videos like this one. Also, if we don't see them burn by the end of the day, then that's that's a confirmed theory. You know, that's probably the reason why. And if we see them end up burning when Bone gets a little bit of hype to it, um, then that 100% confirms it. But if you guys want to start trading with Marjax, use my link down below, um, as well as if you guys want to check me out on Patreon and, and Twitter, feel free to do that as well. But I'm going to get out of here, and I'll catch you in the next one. See ya.